This is time three. I've tried to make this video three times and have failed each time. So we'll see if this one works too. I wonder if it's what I'm the message I'm trying to deliver. In conversation today with a friend of mine, we spoke about, and you've heard me speak before about the importance of conflict, the importance of um, offering how something is hitting you or something that you need in the relationship, something that a promise that wasn't delivered or just clarification um, and how that real and raw is so important. What I'm going to offer you today is in discussion, my friend and I spoke about how when you offer that, even that gentle corrective of, dude, you're being a dickhead. And let me tell you how in a loving way, right away, the cord between you gets super clean and clear because you're not doing that to hurt or harm, but you're also making everything super honest, real and raw. And in that honesty, there's that trust that instantly is there. The person can relax and be vulnerable and can, you can start the dialogue of, yeah, I own that. Or I don't know. Let's, let's look at that together. Let's talk that through, you know? So what I'm going to offer you today and, and what I brought away from that is not just in partnership with your intimate partner, but in your friendships that I hope, like me, you really invest in. So as you invest in these friendships, do they pass that mark of raw and real? Do they pass the test of you offering either a pretty rough corrective with love or saying, listen, this didn't feel good when you did this or didn't do this? And, and see if that rapport is right there because it, in a real, true, real and raw friendship, right away it comes up in like such a beautiful way. And that's what we were talking about today, that even if you hate collision, what comes out of it is just so, it makes the relationship clean and you can do anything from there because both ends, like that line of communication is now like golden. So look at your relationships. Where in your relationships can you be more real and raw? Where in your relationships can you bring a clean collision for further clarity and, and further deepening your trust as a friend? So that's what came up for me today. And it was such a beautiful conversation. So I offer it to you to kind of think about, roll around in your head. And I will see you tomorrow.